The capital cities of countries tend to have rather unique names, but that logic seems to go out the window when we look at Mexico and its capital, called Mexico City. The capital of America isn't called America City, the capital of Germany isn't called Germany City, and the capital of England isn't called England City. So why is it we have this Central American country that's capital city has the same name as the country itself? Well, the reason this seems so weird is because we, well, I am anyway, are looking at this the wrong way round. The capital city wasn't named after the country Country, but rather the country was named after the capital city. So how did Mexico City come to be? And of course what does that name of Mexico even mean? Well we aren't too sure exactly where the name comes from but we have a couple ideas. The first of these ideas is that the name comes from the name of the Aztec god Huitzli or Pochli. Maybe I said that right? Who is the god of war, sun and human sacrifice. Now I know that sounds nothing like the name Mexico but that's because this god actually had a couple other not as well known names Mexili and Mexiliti. It it's from these names for the god we got Mexico, which is thought to mean a place where Huxley or Pochley resides. The second idea for the name Mexico comes from is from the Nahuatl language, with it being a combination of the Nahuatl Metzli meaning moon and Zikli meaning navel. It's thought that these words put together mean either the navel of the moon, the place at the center of the moon or even the child of the moon. So like I said the country of Mexico was named after Mexico City, but Mexico City wasn't originally called that. In fact there was a completely different city entirely on the land. This was the Aztec city of Tenochtitlan, originally known as Mexico Tenochtitlan. Shitland. Yes, that does sound like I'm saying something rude. Let's just move on with it. This city was established in 1325 on an island in the center of Lake Texcoco by a group of Aztecs also called the Mexicars. The legend goes that the aforementioned god Huitzilopochtli ordered his priests to look for where the pickly pear cactuses grew and there build a temple in his honor. It's because of this the name Tecnochitlan is believed to mean among the prickly pears growing among rocks. This city is thought to have been a thing of beauty with a market that thousands would visit every day, trading things like gold and silver. The city became the center of the Aztec Empire, but unfortunately the city was more or less leveled and destroyed in 1521 by Spanish conquistador Hernán Cortés. He however realized the importance of the location of the city he destroyed, so he founded a new Spanish city on its site. He named this city after a part of the original Aztec name for their city, calling it Mexico City, which was the start of the city that stands there to this day. Along with Mexico City, the Spanish also founded their colony of Nueva España, New Spain, that at its peak covered the majority of modern Mexico and parts of modern US. The land area of Mexico was ruled by the Spanish under New Spain until 1821, when after over 11 years of war, Mexico gained its own independence, with Mexico City becoming its capital, and just Mexico becoming the name of the country, leading to the confusing state of Mexico City being the name of the capital of Mexico. However, this isn't the only country that's capital city has the same name as it. A couple other examples of this is that the capital of Luxembourg is Luxembourg City, the capital of Kuwait is Kuwait City, and the capital of Panama is Panama City. Yet it was Mexico and Mexico City that we looked into today because the country of Mexico was suggested by Justin Thomas and Larry Peterson over on Patreon, and thanks to their suggestion, they will now be honored as the Name Explained Patron Saint of Mexico. If you want to become a Name Explained Patron Saint, then why not support the channel over on Patreon from a dollar and up and suggest a country for the next Patron Saint video. And of course thank you to all my patrons, these extra Tuesday videos wouldn't exist without the support of you guys, so if you enjoy these videos and want to be a greater part of our name explain community, then why not support the channel, just $2 a month gets your name here with all these awesome people, thank you.